Yeah, I see what we got going on around here. You want to dabble in some shave a coin to you? Just like the safe moon, the brownies. I had a dog named Sheba. She was a German shepherd. And if she was alive right now, she'd be <laughs> biting the shit out of you. <laughs> oh, you guys want to always, you know. <laughs> Uh, request these shit coins like a uh, Shiba coin. If my dog Shiba was alive still, <laughs> she'd be ripping the shit out of you right now. If you want me to put out Shiba coin and Moon coin, you better be listening to Commodity Mondays tomorrow and Fiscal and Monetary Policy Fridays. You got that, the jabronis? Their money at it. Right? It's garbage. Um, if you're in it, Give me some details of how much you have of this shit. Because it's not good. You can see you're in this falling wedge formation. In this middle line here. You know, plays significance. Not because of that wedge. But we're going to make it. And it's got to be. Bam. There you go. Um, Because you can see just off a of good TA right here. You, know, you got support. Support. Then it crashes through. Then resistance. Then it goes down. Then hits it as resistance. And goes down. Then it blows through it. Then it comes back and now it's riding in as support again. So this line holds major support and resistance on this young coin's life, right? <clears throat> and then you can see this is playing some significance as we pull our industry exclusive drawing tool out. And I turn my brightness up. You can see resi support, resistance, resistance, right? We've hit it there briefly. And then we hit it as resistance, resistance a couple times, and now it broke out. And now we got all these moving averages in the way, right? That's a problem. It's a big problem for this coin right now in its young life. You got a lot of moving averages in the way, and I think a lot of heavy sell pressure because look at that. There's no volume anymore. And the big volume, the three big spikes in volume, sell, sell, sell. So what that means is all them shysters and fleecers and heisters of this coin that got loaded up to promote it and got loaded up because they made it, sold in every rally and then it dumped then every time the price pumped they just dumped and they dumped now there's no more of that uh selling into the market and the hysteria from the retail to buy those shares up to make those guys rich so the volume's dead now because they're done selling they've unloaded all their coins and if i had to guess um we got to get some reason but that's why you start out from the far out time frame because you see how super simple and easy it is uh, to trade this market when you start from the far out time frame and then you see you got major support and resistance rate of vial you see that and you say how the fuck did you come up with that because bam support and resistance support resistance right now it's coming back so we know that plays significance and as I zoom in now for more sexy going data points because there's more hour time frame data points than the four hour time frame you see you're running in the overhead 200 and that's major resistance if you can squeeze above it you could come up to this point i don't know six zeros and a seven you know, and then you're going to get rejected i think you're coming back down here in the near future and then you're coming back down now but you're gonna have to break that and then trade and then down i think you're coming way down in this coin yes you could pop real quick but i think you would get topped out that point, a bunch of zero seven three two is as high as you're gonna go in that garbage. I do not recommend even being in that. But if you want to gamble, you go do whatever the fuck.